Hi there, sign of Virgo. This is Kim here to do a reading for you all. This is going to be for your yearly overview. I'm excited. I hope this is a good reading. I really, really do. Um, we're going to start with the tarot because I'm going to clear, I'm going to clear the table off after the tarot and then we will do the Oracle cards. So we're going to use the modern witch tarot deck. I'm just going to get right into it. Um, I always want to send out my gratitude to everybody. Thank you for liking, sharing, of course, subscribing. I just appreciate you being here with me, keeping me company, and hopefully I keep you company. <sighs> All right. For Virgo, what do they have to look forward to? 2022 from Virgo. Hmm. Maybe some good news in the legal department. Yeah, 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 yeah. Justice, Six of Pentacles, Four of Swords, beautiful combination. Really, really good combination. Virgo, you are the Six of Pentacles energy. So you're, you know, your energy's here. It's giving and receiving. Of course, we have charity. We have healing. I feel like there is a justice situation that's going to have a really uh, good healing Sometimes healing hurts, um, but in the end, this justice system, this whatever this is, it turns out well. It turns out balanced, um, and, and, and I don't know, I'm getting, okay, a chance to prove, a chance to prove yourself, a chance to prove, to say, or to show that how much you've healed this possibly could be like going to recovery. It can be something like that. And this could be, I mean, you know, this is not an easy process. Oh, here's four swords. You're healed. No, 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 no. Um, it could take years sometimes for certain things to get completely healed. Sometimes things are never completely healed. Um, but you're always whole because the experience wasn't you to begin with. Um, it didn't define you. It defined you if you wanted it to, but then you put your own limitation on yourself by giving yourself a definition. So just don't do that to yourself. Um, Four of Swords, Gemini energy, Justice, Libra energy. So, you know, um, justice is the truth. Um, but it's like a, as long as you're trying and you're being, there's something about the truth and as long as the honesty is there, with the truth, even if it's something like a confession, it's this is still like something that's going to turn out really good. Now, this could be civil issues. You could be the person that um, that that actually works in the court systems. That that could be you too. <clears throat> so this might be some people getting involved in um, social justice. Oh wow, wow! Social justice came to mind. That's great. <laughs> That's great because that usually, um, usually that doesn't really pop up with justice. So there are some things about the give and take, things being reciprocal, um, that, that we're going to state this year, that this year are going to be changed. There's going to be changes. There's going to be changes in the way justice is viewed and the way justice is handed out because there's some things that it's just, they're just way, um, it's like they're archaic. There's some things that are in archaic times and, and they just need a little like adjusting sometimes. And you're going to be part of that. You see the balance? You're, you're the main driving force in this balance. Whatever you are healing, it's healing lines and uh, ancestral lines. It's healing that too. So you're getting over some huge karmic, um, things right now you may be um so this may be the year of wrapping up like karmic karmic ties and healing them and truly healing them virgo yeah don't resist a change don't resist a change page of wands is sitting here saying look this bed rest is what you needed this healing this recovery you had to have this your whole body looks like it was going to break down if you didn't have this Page, page of Wands is talking about the good news that comes from your healing. 
Healing yourself heals me. And the death in the reverse, um, sometimes endings are hard, but yours comes with a, psh, seriously, <laughs> yours comes with the fool and the magician. So I wouldn't be resisting at all, Virgo. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Do you see this? The way that you invest um, and use opportunities with your money, something's going to really pay off. Something's going to, an investment's going to pay off. And that is going to lead you to this new adventure, new relationship with your pentacles. Um, this is going to be using this for, um, for good. I feel like this isn't resistance to change now that I'm, now that I'm, like feeling a little more as I'm looking at it. As I'm looking at it, I'm thinking some fires are left burning. Some fires are left burning. Some fires are better left burning. I don't know. And it, it might be due to transformation. There may be um, a little of the something from your, from the old that stays, right? A little something that stays, and then most of it's going to be no, like a new normal. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So, Page of Wands is my good news card. New passionate beginnings. And, and here's your new beginning, your fresh start. I mean, after a big time of healing, this can be emotional or physical healing. It doesn't have to be, um, you know, anything in specific. It feels like recovery for a lot of people. <clears throat> Page of Wands could be um, a child energy, a... A fire sign child energy. The death could be Scorpio energy. Magician. Magician and the fool. I sometimes relate to Aries. Um, new beginnings. You know. Ace of Pentacles. This is a new beginning and a new relationship with money. I truly believe that. I truly believe that. And it's, it comes during a time that was not hopeful. It's going to come during a time that wasn't hopeful. Oh, it's going to give you many more choices and options. You have the choice to slip back. You can't... Uh, what do I say? Okay, how do I say this? You can't go backward, but you can relearn lessons, if that makes sense. But there's some things that your body aren't going to be able to take anymore um, in a new energy yeah, so so listen, this is a lot of options too. This is about choices, about options, about you having these choices. Um, yeah, seven, seven. Do you have the choice? I feel like you, you're going to be surprised to get through the deception, to see through the deception. Ooh. Oh, wow. And it's around something with money. And money is good. And money is real good. This is, oh wow, okay, so I'm feeling so many things. Uh, I'm feeling that, um, well, the exchange rate, the exchange rate, I'm feeling like investments paying off, like, um, uh, I don't know, like, you know those little stock investments? Cryptocurrency investments? Really good ideas with investing. Knowing that there's going to be like something, something different with the money or your money or the money. Anything else for Virgo? This looks absolutely fantastic. Ooh, it was just a matter of time, Virgo. Your spirit guides, your angels. Um, I, f I feel like they have a message of, um, we were just waiting for you to shine your light. Like the whole world was waiting for Virgo to shine your light. Because the epitome of social justice and service, you know, providing service is Virgo. Virgo energy all about this kindness. And Virgo can also be the most critical sign to themselves. So there's a lot of healing that's coming in here. Your angels are helping you. It's all in divine timing. They're going to help you put this balance back in your life, but it's going to be a balance towards the light. It'll be a balance towards the light. 
just um, know that 2022 will probably, you know, as the light grows, um, so does the shadow. So you may see or have things happen that, that we just have to accept, radical acceptance and understand divine timing and trust and trust in our journey and trust that this is okay, that everything's going to be okay. A lot of inspiration with the red, a lot of leader, leader, um, meant leader, meant leadership, knight of pentacles in the reverse, somebody that was not as dependable, not wanting to fight, not wanting to compete, not wanting to compete. Let's do some Oracle cards, guys. Um, Sagittarius energy, temperance. Lots of Aries energy here. Um, I'm going to leave that. That's really good. It's actually a really good spread. I like it. Um, these are all the good things to come. All the good things to come. 2025. 2025, really? Did I say that? 2022. Goodness. <laughs> all right. Then and another message is don't relearn the lesson. Don't relearn the lesson. You don't have to relearn a lesson. Sixes is a time of harmony. Four is a time of stability. And then look at all the other stuff. The magician, you have the magic. So 2022 is probably going to be a magical year. Um, self-reliance, preserve, uh, preservation, preservation, discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to death and it's coming at the ace of pentacles, death to feeling like, you know, how to control stability because you, we don't, <laughs> we don't, there's nothing really predictable in this energy that's coming up. Um, Nothing's going to be predictable. So the best thing to do is have a good attitude. Have that King of Swords attitude with the discipline. So, um, yeah, I can accomplish what I set my mind to. Death, I learned that the endings are merely beginnings. Balance, I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world, and I do so without judgment. <clears throat> blame oh i feel like this is re releasing blame um and, and also releasing any feelings of guilt you know um understanding there are soul contracts and understanding that some people are just playing a role and we are all merely players in a play and some people do real good jobs at playing their part um Blame, I accept responsibility for my well-being. So no more blame game. No more blaming others for how you feel, basically. Um, perseverance, I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to. If you persevere, of course. Perseverance and friendship. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. There's going to be lots of relationships, could be friendships too, where um, that's going to be the issue is finding balance and harmony. And, and usually some kind of hard choices come up for us. Um, but gosh, this feels like it's going to be a magical year for you. I'm so excited, actually. I really like all this. Um, let's get... Let's get some of these, and then I'll probably wrap up your reading. I've got to get, get um, Capricorns done. Against the grain, release the dark wound. Let love live. Let love live. Okay, for Virgo. What energy do we have? 2022 for Virgo. Oh, oh wow. You got the same thing that um, Taurus got. Pandora's gift. So this feels like that's going to be 2022 <laughs> to me. I feel like it's going to be Pandora's gift where it is the hope that's left in the box. But you got to understand all of the things that got out when she opened that box. Okay, so yeah, there are things um, 
There are things in the box that got out into the world. There are energies that we need to, well, become aware of, accept them, love them, and then compassionately these things move in, you know, out of our way. Um, 34, I love this card. It says, in the world, not of the world. Because you're in the world for sure, because you're in this body, you're in this bio suit, but you are a soul, so you're actually an invisible essence or um, a light child. I like to call it children of the light. You're children of the light or light children. So you're not of this world. You're from a different place, but you better. Your light is what helps this world. You're a legacy of light. Oh, I love this. So this card just reminds us to have faith in the process um, like the nostalgia here from a long time ago, you know, when you have uh, the red wagon, it says faith on it. And I love the sweet birds. One's on her back and one's down here. And she's just praying because that's what you do. That's what you do. Knowing that some things are hard, but having faith in the process. Knowing that it will be okay. That all will be okay. All right, let's get some. Um, let's get some of these fairy, fairy dust. Fairy dust practice. Whoa, practice. After a while, you'll dance on air. Practice makes you perf perfect. Perfect. <laughs> You're almost there. The green fairy, a cheeky green fairy, on your behalf is appearing here to make you laugh, and it did, and it did. Let's do tea leaves. Doesn't take much though. I like to laugh. <laughs> tea leaves. Yeah, for sure. Look, there's got to be some kind of court issue here. It's okay. It's okay. Something feels like a mistake. Something feels like a misunderstanding. And the message is that you're. it's okay, Virgo. You will be shown the way. Don't believe any stories that may make you feel like something's, uh, you know, no hope. Because you have Pandora's gift. You have the gift after the promise, you know, from your creator, from source, from your father. You have the gift, Pandora's gift of hope. And, and it will show you the way. It will show you the way. Table is hard work ahead. Seems like the harder you work, the luckier you get. Dark woman, dealings or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or dark hair. Probably would work better on a solo, <laughs> on a private reading, right? Okay. Older man, dealings or relationship with older man. Rat, someone working against you behind your back. Well, like I said, the greater your light, the bigger the shadow you cast. Sometimes this is remote access to like a to your telephone so just make sure that um you're not leaving your phone with anybody even if it has a lock on it just be really careful about your phone this year bull maybe Taurus. do not back down from the opposition show strength and fortitude i feel like this has to do with a legal thing with some kind of legal situation egg success is assured with good plans and hard work Teardrops, great personal sorrow, fan, romance, celebration, or party, hammock, taking a vacation physically or mentally, firecracker, excitement, cobweb, protected from negative forces beyond your control, so don't worry about that rat. Your spirit team is going to take control of that situation too. First, pay attention to your finances. Like I said, with your phone, just be careful with your phone. I feel like you're going to hit your target. You're, you're going to do what you wanted to do, what you set out to accomplish. Um, gavel, involvement with the law, target, a goal-oriented person. It's going to be okay. Do not back down from opposition here, Virgo. All right, that's what I got for you for your yearly. I hope you enjoyed that, got something out of it. Sending you light and love. Bye, guys.